And we are hearing from Quincy Public School officials as well as the attorney mounting a legal challenge to their quarantine policy. It comes from three families whose kids were exposed to COVID-19 last week. They say even though none has tested positive or shown any symptoms, the district isn't allowing their kids to go back to school. WGEM's Blake Salmon is standing by live in Quincy with details. Blake. Dylan, that's right. I'm here at the Quincy Holiday Inn where we are spent, set, set to talk to Tom DeVore. He's the attorney representing the three families in this matter. And according to documents, court documents that DeVore filed with the Adams County Circuit Court, the Adams County Health Department issued the three families an, an, an immediate order to quarantine last week until September 4th. But Divorce says those orders can only be legally in effect for 48 hours or until a court issues a quarantine order. He says no such order has come down for any of the three kids, and uh, without it, the district doesn't have the authority to keep them out of school. But Superintendent Roy Webb says by not allowing the kids back in school, they're just following the guidance handed down to them by the state and the Adams County Health Department. The best thing that they could do is, is to make it a, a legal case and, uh, and take us to court because then we either validate what we're doing or it shows that uh, we're not doing the right thing. Now the Adams County Circuit's the Adams County Circuit clerk says a ruling could come down as soon as tomorrow. Live in Quincy, I'm Blake Salmon, WGEM News.